So for question number 26, we're going to be drawing Br2O. So looking at the formula, this actually looks very similar to H2O, right? So remember H2O look like this. Now remember that bromine, we said that often bromine is, uh, participates in single bonds like chlorine and fluorine. So let's predict a structure like this for Br2O. So let's see, bromine has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven valence electrons here, seven valence electrons here. Oxygen has one, two, three, four, five, six, six valence electrons, and all three atoms have full octet. So this is the correct structure for Br2O. We can check this by doing by looking at the octet electrons. So uh, we have three atoms that all want an octet, so three times eight equals twenty-four. And then if we do, bromine has 7 valence electrons, so times 2 is 14, plus 6 is 20. So 24 minus 20 equals 4, divided by 2 gives you 2. So that means that there are two bonds, so we would have predicted this structure.